I'm June. I served as a national park ranger for more than 20 years. Um, back when I first started, I had the good fortune to work with Jim Reverts. We have stayed good friends ever since. Today, I will walk you through the Yellowstone caldera. You will learn what it is, how it formed, and why it continues to shape this land. Let's get started. Yellowstone supervolcano is part of the Yellowstone caldera, a giant volcanic basin formed during a massive eruption about 640,000 years ago. The caldera measures about 30 miles wide, by 45 miles long, and lies beneath much of Yellowstone National Park. The park's famous geothermal features, geysers, hot springs, fumaroles, and mud pots are surface expressions of the heat still present underground. Beneath Yellowstone, the magma chamber is vast. It holds a combination of molten rock and pressurized gases. Scientists monitor it closely for changes. Most activity remains steady and well below eruption thresholds. If a super eruption were to occur, it would eject ash across much of North America, disrupt global weather and have long lasting effects on agriculture and climate. However, such events are very rare and there is no sign of an impending eruption. I hope you enjoyed this fun national park fact. For more history, check out Jordans of the Pond by my friend Jim Reverts. It tells the true story behind Jordan Pond House in Acadia.